Hey everybody, it's Charles Knight. Welcome back for more Final Fantasy V Advance. This is episode 30. Let's go get new weapons. Oh yeah, still room. Now let's put the Asus tablet. Ah oh, yeah, seizures. Let's sacrifice this tablet. Let's get new weapons. Legendary Pokemon. Uh, Holy Lands. Let's get this! Ah, seizures! Holy lands! Holy lands! A very nice holy element spear! That are effective towards undead monsters. Very good for extant soul. Let's get this one, it's also nice! Ah, seizure! Sage staff! Sage staff! Boost! Holy element magic! It's a nice rod or a staff to increase the holy magic spell. Let's get this as well. Ah, dang it, my eyes! You reach his bow! You reach his bow! Powerful bow! High critical hit ratio! Okay, that bull has a high crit ratio, and that's it. Goodbye, Asus tablet. Oh shit! Well, I still have my laptop. I'm gonna get some more tablets to get the other legendary Pokémons. No cutscene this time. Let's go. Am I in a good mood today? I think I'm. Uh, I'm in a balanced mood. Slightly heartbroken, but also okay. Ah, girls never fail to break my heart. Well, some girls, but not all. Oh, just focus on this LP and just continue it. Okay, that's four titles. Drop here. This is Crescent. Crescent. Phantom Village. What the? Don't mock me. You're the same mage that mocked us when our ship got sucked by a whirlpool. You piece of shit. That's what Smith gonna say. Hey, come here. What? It's uh, say this underground. We gotta save him. Yeah. Y okay. Don't worry. We'll save him. We're superheroes. We're the heroes of this game. Okay, you would want to go here. This is Crescent Revisit. Crescent Revisited. I think there's no loots. There's a piano, but your piano is also is already mastered. But talk to this guy first. Why don't you play me a song? Then maybe a song for you will come to mind. Okay, let's play it. Let's play Bart's music. Oh man, Bart, you're so good. Oh yeah, really? Well, thanks! Scenery Etude! Yeah, increases the string and battle, and you also get Hero Song, which increases level stats, or your character stats. It doesn't really increase your level, but increase your stats. So it's kinda nice. And I guess we got all the songs. Wow! Thank you, Lord! When I was a kid, I never collected all the songs because I was just focused on clearing the game. But when you're finally doing Let's Plays, you really wanna make the most out of it. Even if I can't complete all the Beast Cherry, at least I'll get some magics or finish the side quest ending. Let's continue! We don't need to use the ship anymore. It's near. Fort Tower. Barrier Tower. <laughs> just kidding. And yeah, that's the same music, Exit Castle. Oh yeah, let's go! And the spells aren't ticking, at the same time, this tower is gonna go BOOM! So you gotta split up. Okay. Uh, left... Uh, I see, thanks first. What? Yeah, I know, Crow, that's so cute. There's your, you're a cute girl. Uh, 
Oh man, close call. I remember that the warrior should be at the right side. The right side is physical tower. Only physical and damaging is allowed there. While the left side is the magic tower. Only magics can work there. Your swords and and fists will not be of use or you'll get a punishment for using it. Okay, first is a melee, melee fighter, so yeah, let's go to the right. And Krile, let's go to the left. Yeah, go with Lena, you cute girl. You are so mo moe. <laughs> okay, I guess we're gonna control the magic first. Magic character, so the black tower has flare. Let's continue. This place doesn't have much of a devastating encounter rate. Unlike the past dungeons like the Pyramid and Island Shrine. Those places really pissed me off. I have to do a lot of editing, removing random bells and chatter, but this place doesn't have too much encounter. Oh, speak of the devil. Damn you devil, die devil, you're so evil! Okay, let's just kill this. Chrono Controller, um, a magic type beast, I think if you attack it physically, it's gonna counter with something devastating. But it only has low HP, so one good summon will kill it, yeah. That's good. What's this? Ether. Gonna be useful because we're gonna need magic. Richard Mage. Oh man, it's me. Richard. Richard Bonipasio Mage. What the F? Well, this is the same Richard Mage from World 1. It has terrible stats, so you can usually one hit it. it only has 100 HP. I wonder why they put it in here. I guess they're recycling the folds. Okay, Richard, goodbye. I killed myself. Flame rod, you can get flame rods there. Okay, let's continue. My friend visited me yesterday and we played some Smash Brothers Brawl and uh, what else? Well, Phantom Brave. And this is a Wonderland. Nothing is too wondrous about this. Okay, let's check it out. It has zero attack power, but it has a boost in magic. That's terrible. Why would you want a weapon with zero attack? Well, I guess it's gonna be useful when you get confused and you accidentally hit your other allies, but since it has zero attack, it doesn't damage them. Well, that sucks. That's the only wondrous thing about it. I guess it can randomly cast some spell if you break the rod. Okay, we've completed Lena. Let's go use Nayuts, Nayuki. <laughs> Let's go. I hope the encounter rate is the same, only small encounter rate. Uh, so hot, dang it. The humidity is terrible. And they said summer was over, but I guess it's not really over even if it's over. Uh, dang it, so hot. Okay, I guess it's gonna be enough. I'm gonna get some points with Faris because I'm gonna use her for the boss battle and Ranger. I need to get rapid fire for to her as well. Defender! Okay, I Defender is somewhat good because it has a blocking ability. It gives you some evade. Well, I think Excalibur is stronger. Evade is good because it's gonna protect you from physical damage a bit. Oh, I heard that thunder. The weather is starting to get bad. Maybe it's gonna rain. Which is slightly good, but if it browns out, then my let's play is screwed. Although my laptop has a battery, so... built in battery, so yeah. Still, still has battery life. So, yep, no need to take this too seriously, but you can use your defensive equipment, like Genji equipment and the ones with more defense. Don't use bone melt since you can't heal. 
We're just going to rely on our high potions. We're going to have two boss battles, guys. Two boss battles. Let's do this first. We ate the ball and we're going to fight boss battle Minotaur. If you remember Sekhmet, this is his brother, Minotaur. Rapid fire. Oh, sh oh what the up the F man it heals him oh so it's holy element dang sorry fellas then I'm just gonna switch the equipment what the damage but don't panic because Minotaur doesn't have, have good HP it's gonna die soon enough only two characters can whip his ass let's find a defender yes, that's better because it's gonna help you parry some attacks. Get the defender. Where is it? Defender. Now it's switch with Excalibur. Let's rapid fire. Yeah. Our favorite signature attack. Overused attack in Final Fantasy V. Rapid fire. Come on. You can do. Oh shit. Dang. Only two hits for me. I hit you can do it. Make a crit. Dang, the Yuichibo won't crit right now. Go rapid fire! Come on, die, I hope you die soon. You brother of Sekhmet evilness. The power of holy magic. It's steam time to taste his might. No MP! <laughs> Send your ability points, that's good. That's so funny. He wants to cast magic, but this is the physical tower. And he doesn't have MP, so he can't use it. Yeah, it's gonna blow, so you better press A. You won't get it unless you press A. So press A. Lena ate the ball, and... Boss Bell! Omniscient! Okay, this boss. You're just gonna have to use your magical damaging techniques against it. If you plan to attack it physically, it's gonna automatic counter with return. So yeah, it's gonna restart the bell. Because return is like a uh, time machine spell. So don't rely on physical attacks. Just use your Sildras and your Tundagas or whatever. Let's try getting it. Come on. Sildra. Let's can't believe uh, Gaia's Rat did little damage. But I already had the Magus Rod and also the Gaia Gear. But I guess. Titan is already weak at this point in the game. Let's... Uh, hmm. Silence? I heard it works because if you attack it with a mute sword, it's not gonna attack. Nevertheless, it's half physical attack. So I don't wanna risk using mute sword. Anyways. And I really hope their characters has decent HP before this boss dies because bosses like this has the final blow technique it's just a specialized technique in which when they die they automatically cast a magic which, which doesn't cost any turns and might kill your party or damage it badly I think it's auto counter auto magic counter so yeah let's just silver it away Lightning storm or wind storm. Ouch, my eyes. We can do this, guys. Let's, let's kill it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Reflect damage. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. 270. Thunderstorm. I'm gonna use black magic, but I, I want some healing. So I always have to bring white. Uh oh! Uh, ouch. He hit the character with the coral ring. Super effective! Uh oh, oh, oh. Close call. I thought I was gonna die. I'm already far, so don't die. Don't die, Kryl! We have to win! Because if we lose in this battle, we have to start again from the first floor up. War Tower and have to fight Minotaur again. 
Haste too, I got fine, let's speed up. I think I should have speed up because he's gonna die soon enough. Uh, nevertheless, speed up, whatever. Uh oh. Oh yeah, I remember Kodor Ring, so nullify fire damage. Okay. Okay, he's dead! Final counterattack! Flare! Oh man! Cry was scorched, 1000 damage, wow. That's big damage. You got lots of ability points? That's good. Obtain the black magic, flare, and holy. Uh-oh. But we did it, so it should not explode, right? It's disappearing. Well, it's better to disappear than to explode. Because our limbs will explode if it explodes. <sighs> My heart is in pain. I stopped to mid. Uh, mid. We already destroyed the. Uh, we already removed Fork Tower, so your grandpa's pretty safe. Or maybe he's still down there, maybe he's crushed. So let's help Sid. Stop mocking me, you stupid black mage or whatever. Don't pick on me, like when you picked on me due to the tall whirlpool. Okay, let's go. I don't want any more encounters. You have to use, you have to ride this or get down there. Oh yeah, gotta love, gotta love that Bronker Ruins music. Oh yeah, can save here. Oh whoa whoa, Sid, what a, he's going circles. You spin me. <laughs> Oh, hey Sid, aren't you injured from getting trapped by the gears and you get you get sliced by the gears or you're not bloodied? It's okay. No, oh, it's all right. It's gonna fix something for us. Oh yeah! Hey Chaga, quick speed! Uh, all the speeding spells. That's super fast. Shouldn't take much longer. Grandpa blames himself for the world having ended up like this. I know that, I think deep down he knows it too. But that's why this time he's gonna use his machine for peace. And that should do it. Once you're in the water, press down in A. Wow. Is that breaking the fourth wall? Why are you telling us the game mechanics? Mates, I can't fight for beans. I'm just good with technology. Even so, I did the best I can. The rest is in your hands. You gotta save this world so that Chardis can save Fulco. Come on, guys! Yippee! Hey, luck, bro! No problem. You take care too. You guys take care too. Take care, Crow. They're so cute, Crow. No point in dawdling. Let's go! 
Epic Music The Dawn Warriors music, let's go. Hmm. We're almost running out, we're almost out of time. So I guess I'm gonna end it here. No, just kidding. I'm not gonna end it here yet. Okay guys, welcome back. We still have a, a little time for a side quest. So this is the area. See the cross? That's where I am. This is near Bal Castle. This is Jekyll Cave. Okay, deep in the deep part of Jekyll Cave, there's a place where you can climb. Last time, you climbed there to get to the overworld so you can save. This time, you climb there to get somewhere else. So I hope your characters are ready. I hope you have some break, catablee pass, and break spell blade. Or rapid fire or zenin age that's gonna help you a lot in this upcoming something dang the encounter rate is high again oh an esper let's talk of it came here trying to best me eh hey pt i don't have time to fight the likes if i could spare you say one minute still wanna rumble uh no i don't want to i don't want to fight you odin um, I want to get you so yes it's your funeral boss battle with time limit Odin Odin one minute to fight him he has decent HP is psychic powerful the time limit will screw you over if you can't damage him fast enough if your characters are low leveled you are better off trying to get a chance of petrifying him there's things that can petrify, spell blade petrify, or break petrify. And that's it, it got hit. Petrifies his weakness, he's dead. Receive the summon monster. Odin! That was a fast side quest. Guess we get another powerful Esper. Now uh, let's get out of this place. <sighs> you can't teleport? Why? Is it because we're not in a dungeon? But that's a dungeon. Well, it is Bal Castle Basement, so I guess it's not a dungeon. Well, no, wait. It's still a dungeon. Eh, whatever. Game logic. I miss this music. Uh, me too, you're not the only one. Let's get out of this place, Bell Castle. Now we can save. And we finished Fork Tower and got Odin. A decent episode if I say so myself. We'll continue this in the next episode. Thank you for watching, this is Charles Knight. Commentaries! Here we like it if you subscribe.